Reverend Colonel here. Guess uh, you could call me a little bit of a Renaissance man, because not only do I do carpentry and metalwork and welding and and mechanical stuff and all that kind of stuff, but I love to cook in the kitchen. Tonight we're doing a Southern venue, and I'll give you all a shot of this. Um, got some green fried tomatoes there southern specialty got some blackened catfish got some okra boiling in the pot there some rice and beans and special cheesecake made with cream cheese and uh, using crescent rolls. So uh, this is how we do it in the South. This is the kind of cooking that we do. This is what we've done for tradition, for generations upon generations. This is the kind of food you eat in the South. So anyway, just thought I'd share something a little different. Um, I'm gonna be doing a video here soon. Uh, something mechanical or working with metal or something like that is what I'm going to do. And I'm going to share a little bit of a message about the Valley of Dry Bones. And for those of you that are wondering, my wife is getting along great. She's a lot further along than they thought she would be in her recovery. She's still doing oxygen uh, but she's here at home, she's doing home health care, and she's doing a whole lot better, and she is definitely on her way of healing. Doctor said she was a, a uh, poster child for American uh, health care, and uh, what he meant by that is that uh, uh, it was the health care here that got her well. And if she had been anywhere else in the world, a lot of other places, she might not have made it. So uh, she was right at the edge of death. And she is here with us miraculously by the grace of God. But I knew she would be because God kind of tuned me into that and let me know that she'd be fine and she'd make it. So have faith out there, all you brothers and sisters read your Bible, be reading your scriptures. Like I said, I'm reading Ezekiel right now. I just read about the Valley of Dry Bones and I will share about that later. Uh, stay in your faith. Keep praying for my wife. I appreciate it and for me. And, uh, you know, um, uh, subscribe to my channel. Please, subscribe. Uh, I'm trying to get the Word of God out there in a unique way through different various things and uh, you know be able to help other brothers and sisters in Christ and maybe even help those who don't even know the Lord so uh, the more people I can get to subscribe to the channel the more hits I'm gonna get and the more people we're going to be able to, to uh, help out and the more people that will get God's Word so anyway that's it today uh, southern cooking yeah that's what we do this is the way Reverend Colonel signing out